Hello ladies, I am here with a little project share and I picked up at the Dollar Tree the other day um, this Crafter Square cutting die. It was the only die I have ever seen from the Dollar Tree and I thought it was cute so I wanted to try it out and look at this. Look how cute this is. So I have some scrap papers that I've been playing around with in my stash just I keep a little basket under my desk and I just toss in some scrap papers so all this is just some scrap papers and Dollar Tree die this one here and I just made like a little I don't know I'll probably put it on a card front or I could put use it as a topper or I can use it to decorate a gift bag or whatever it's just a little little something something and then I used this little bicycle flare it comes like a set of four these are in the bins they were the park lane they're at the bins in Joann's so I don't know it was like a dollar 99 or something and I think it was 50% off the day I'd gotten them they didn't have very many flares left I think that package was actually the only one I found but look how stinking cute that die is. I just love it. So here are just a couple more little embellishments that I made. I didn't use the die on them. But I want to just playing around. And then while I was at the Dollar Tree, I also picked up two packs of hand sanitizer. And I made these cute little hand sanitizer boxes. So how cute and I used again that Dollar Tree die on all these little gift boxes. The hand sanitizer that I used on the inside came in packs of two. So that's why I bought two packs and I just made again these are all just paper scraps from my bin. I was just totally messing around. With some paper scraps. I did follow a tutorial on the little box so I will leave that below. I can't remember who it was that I used because I looked at like a whole bunch of them but anyways I just wanted to share this cute super cute little die and I actually cut a whole stinking bunch of them and I'm just gonna keep them with my Little, I keep all my little scrap stuff in like a bin like this little tray, also from the Dollar Tree. And then when I'm messing around with stuff, I kind of just pick through there and see what I can find. This cute little gold bow is a punch. Let's see if I can find it real quick here. I had it out. Darn it not super handy anyways it's a little bow punch and I just handmade those with again some scrap pieces from my bin this paper collection is this bicycle came from a paper collection that I picked up from uh, Michael's hot buy packs and they were like a strips you know when you get the hot bat um, hot buy packs some of the papers come with like strips of, this one had bicycles. What else did it have? It had, oh, here it is. It had bicycles and lemons. And so I just cut the bicycles out to put them on my packaging. Again, something I had used and a piece of it was, that piece of it that I just showed you was in my bin. So... This is my attempt at just using up some of my super scraps and picking up a couple items from the Dollar Tree that I really wanted to try out. So I have to suggest if you have not gone to Dollar Tree or if you have a Dollar Tree and you see those crafting squares, it cut smooth and it was cut clean and all the little pieces came out just fine. I mean, this was a really good die for a dollar, so I do recommend it, and I think it turned out super cute. Thank you. Have a great day.